been together? Oh. How long have we been together, baby? Forever, ever. Aww. Forever, ever. We need some dates. Forever, ever. Yeah, how long y'all been together? Yeah, we, got, we ain't drinking well, we've been together. together. We've been knowing each other, what? Over 12 years. years. Yeah, about 12 Your mama years. taught me. Your mama was his teacher. Mm. Oh, this is the perfect love story. It is. Going back and forth for a while. Oh. Yeah, yo, but right yo, now, it's just us. It's real okay. now. Yeah. That's what's up. Yeah. Like my other half. So beautiful. Whoa. It is. See, you too tall, honey. Wow. I get that a lot. I do that a lot. <laughs> glad that Melissa and I were able to bring Carly and Jocelyn's relationship back together. But now it's time to stop worrying about other people's relationships and pay attention to my own. I'm glad you are back. Sean and I have been seeing each other for a couple of months, but I've been keeping things under wraps. I just didn't want to ruin things by bringing him around all this drama. I missed you. I miss you too. How long you gonna stay this time? Like two weeks. Two weeks? Yeah. You know, I'm a free agent, so I'm training to go to China for a summer league. You just do whatever's best. For us, right? Sean and I have known each other over 10 years. He's from Memphis, where I'm from, and we met each other back in the day. We tried a couple of times over the years, but it never really worked out. He plays ball, so he travels a lot. I always wanted you to be mine, but... And I wanted you, you to be mine. You was just high-headed and running around and... Doing you. I love where I'm back at. And look where you at now. Yeah, with my baby. We together, like, officially, we a couple. Can you believe now, it? I can't believe it. I can't <laughs> believe it because I always wanted you. Sean and I agreed to take things slow, but we both stopped seeing other people. We're just focusing on us and spending as much time together as we can. So when Carly asked me about the trip with the girls to Jamaica, I had to think long and hard about if I really wanted to go. This girls trip thing, I don't know if I really wanna go, cause I know I'm gonna miss you. Hey, but I'll be here waiting on you. I just don't want it to go left, cause I know Tammy probably gonna be there. And me and Tammy ain't on the best of terms. You shouldn't even got into it with Tammy. Tammy like family. Walk up like family with me, that's so, I don't feel like that's a legit, legitimate beef. I knew you and Walker was cool, but I ain't, I, I really, it didn't dawn on me when I got into it with her. I wasn't thinking about all that. Walker and Sean know each other from back in the day when Sean used to play for the Knicks and Walker used to be in New York a lot. So I know he's a little disappointed that Tammy and I got into it, and I'm a little disappointed myself. I feel like you just need to be the bigger person, you know, because we family. You know, you're so beautiful. I don't like you fighting. Well. I think about it. So you only be like this when you dime. Like when you bird, when you at home, when you around. When you, when People you don't, in Atlanta don't know bird. Well, you I know, know bird. bird. Yeah, and that's what I call you bird to me, so. Well, I don't know what's gonna happen when I come face to face with Tammy, but as of right now, I'm gonna try to be the bigger person. If I can make up with Jocelyn, I know I can make up with Tammy. Jocking basketball, you get to the person who hit. Me and the fellas decided to go shoot some ball. Walker decides to bring his homie, Sean. Me and Sean happen to be on the same team, so I feel pretty good having this not-so-secret weapon. Ooh. Y'all need all the help he gonna get today. So it's Jock and Sean versus me and Kirk. Me and Kirk coming in with our A game. Jock coming in with Sean, the NBA player. You know, he, he oversees shooting threes. We keep doing this, we're gonna cut his hair. We're gonna win. Me and Sean go way back since the Knicks, the Nets. I know him like around the time I met Tim. And it's crazy because now he dating Dom. Can y'all like cheat me some shots in or something? I'm finna make all the shots, don't worry about it. I heard some <laughs> Tammy came home talking about her and Dom arguing. And I found out Sean, her man, I'm like, oh no, that's my man. We don't never get into all that girl drama anyway. Y'all gotta dead that. <laughs> Ooh, you gotta believe. Jock, you cheating. Sean plays professional ball. It's part of what I do. I do wheelies and ride motorcycles. I don't play ball. Nah. <laughs> no. How you know Sean? Man, Sean, my boy. I met Sean years ago. And plus, Sean, they done. Really? Yeah. That's first lady. She a real woman. I love her to death. Good chick. I mean, I know that because yeah. we was at Carly's uh, 
a grand oh, opening. How are you recovering from that bazooka shot? That's his baby. Curry, don't do that. No, Look at that don't. smile. <laughs> <laughs> Check, let me tell you what's crazy, though. So, you know, me and her trying to be cool, too. You know, me and Tommy had a little situation going on. It wasn't even nothing really serious. So, I'm at the damn store. Jessica, uh, she introduced me to Sean. So, everybody like, you know what, Carly? She come in with an AK-47. Man, boy. she comes in here with Caesar from Black Ink, holding his hand. She, bro, she walk in like, hold on. Ooh. I'm trying to look over them like I don't see them, you know what I'm saying? So, so she invited you, right? She invited me, yeah. She, that was some sucker You trying to get back at me for the yeah, time. Yeah, that's some y'all in love, you know? Yeah. That was stuff happening. That ain't love, bro. That's some different kind of love. You kicking it with a snake, expect to get bit. Honey. So you think she a snake? I mean, she got some snaky ways. You already know how messy she is. She all up in my sh Telling Rashida this, that. Man, what's up with you and Rashida, though? Y'all straight? We got that kid relationship going, and I'm trying mm. to just handle the business, but she ain't messing with me like that right now. Rashida's madder than ever because Jocelyn blabbing about us on TV, and all the blogs is just running crazy with this story. She's not really going to be happy with me at all until I take a DNA test, but I'm trying to figure things out because I miss my wife and my family like crazy. Are you in the house right now? Separate houses. I've been trying to give her her space. I really want to just go over there every night. You gotta figure something out, bro. Cause both y'all in dog house sleep. Tim got me on probation. I'm on a sofa, as a matter of fact. We need to plan some shit and try to get y'all life back together. I found out the girls got a little girl trip. They going to Jamaica. Girl trip meaning Tammy and who? She said me, Rashida. Uh -huh. uh, I know Carly and Dime going. Got the game plan. Let go crash the trip. You got your passport? All these lovely ladies in bikinis and thongs. Yeah, yeah, I'm going. Definitely not gonna let Carly Red win the Petty Award this year, because I'm definitely gonna bring something along pretty, you know, scantily clad to make sure I get up under her goddamn skin. The only thing about just popping up on Rashida, I don't did that before, though. <laughs> Try Jamaica. Just do it. So y'all just gonna go to Jamaica. I'm with it. All right, we're going. It's time to go get your wife back, bro. Hi, bitch. My girl Spice. Her homegirl Spice is probably one of the biggest I know artists. Who Spice is. Okay, she got a show tonight. Spice got a new song, right? It's called Sheets. What they do is they put the sheet down. Oh, I see. And they lay they on put top the of the guy. And they just go ah, the book. Ah, 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 ah. <laughs> Girl, let me tell you. You gonna do that tonight? I'm doing it. Who you gonna do it on? No, I ain't trying to get in no trouble. I got a new boo. Caesar, the tattoo shop guy. Oh, no, 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 hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. I just found this out last night. We haven't had sex yet. We're dating. In order to find your husband, you have to date. Okay, but people that date have sex, Carly, Bitch, so this is I'm something. I'm not You know what, I'm Even though you. I have been in a relationship with life, I have been in a relationship with Jock. You have best. been in a relationship with who? I did not know that Don was coming on this trip. I haven't seen her since all that talking at Tommy's wine tasting event. And I'm not too happy to see her here now, to be honest. Two years ago, me and Dom exchanged words through social media. Someone attacked my child for having pink hair, saying that she was too grown. And my response to the person was, I think that pink hair was very age appropriate for 11 year old, but not age appropriate for a grown ass woman. And for some reason, Dom felt as though I was talking about her. Listen, listen, listen. I know that you guys have had your Ting, 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 whatever we're gonna call it. What was that? I'm gonna be honest. Me and you done got into right. our little words on social media. I never disliked you. So when you said something at the wine tasting, uh, while I'm trying to explain that I'm back cool with Jocelyn, I just felt like you blurted it out at the time. I didn't know if you was being sarcastic because we had had problems before. And I may have taken it the wrong way. So if I did, I apologize. Well, I apologize for snapping back. Well, you snapping me, bitch, first. So I, no, I apologize. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> so I was like, I was with the drink, bitch. I said, uh-uh, let me back up, Timmy. No, it was just, I was Timmy about that life. <laughs> I don't really have no beef with Tammy. I'm just not going to get played. But I'm grown enough to know that maybe I overreacted to her little shade. And I'm sorry for all that. So I'm flying high like a bird, like my baby Sean would expect me to fly. We're Everything's good. good. So now that we're good. What's up with y'all? Yesterday was a hot mess. So I put together this boat ride so we could just chill and have one day on this island with no argument, no wig snatching, and no drama. I even told y'all could get tag along. Hell, bring your thoughts. I have to feel bad for the man after his retaliation plan of bringing treasure along just to make me jealous. <laughs> Epic fail. And as long as he keeps treasure far away from us, 
no one's gonna get thrown overboard. Yesterday when Treasure came at you like that, right. it just made me mad. You walked off like, I was like, this, we ain't going out like but this. But you know what, I walked Dang. off and made a good ass opening for you to clock that bitch in the head. <laughs> she was like, choose a side, Jock. But she was like, yeah, choose a side. <laughs> Treasure's taking her ass back to Atlanta. I brought her along just to get on the Carly skin, bad idea. Okay, my up. The whole time though, Carly like, it's Jock. <laughs> From here on out, I'm hoping that this trip is gonna be smooth sailing. I wanna make love. As a matter of fact, one of my homies got a surprise for Dime that's guaranteed to create a whole lot of love making. You dig what I'm saying? You were looking so surprised. Did you die? I was. But not more than this, though. What's up, pretty woman? Sean is here. Here I was feeling all sad and lonely because everybody else's man was here. I should have known not to underestimate my baby. Woo! We on a boat, baby. How did you know we was here? Walk up, walk up, fine. <laughs> <laughs> and, 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 and a little help with the GPS. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hey, Bitch, no. I didn't even know they knew each other. No. Thank you, Walker. You're welcome. I'm glad we cool now. So that beef officially cooked, right? Oh, no, I'm glad we cooled out, bitch. Okay, I want to thank everybody for coming to the party, to the boat party. We having a good time. Thank you, Sean, for making my girl happy. I was, I cried. I cried. When? I cried. I didn't see you cry. I did. I cry. Listen, I cried on the inside. My heart is crying. But here's the thing. As a man, a real mother man, all the shit you done put me through, you can at least apologize. Carl, I've been thinking about this a lot lately. Been a lot of lonely nights. If you don't apologize, I'm going to throw this motherfucking drink on you. You're going to be mad as And I thought about that shit, and I was like, nah, I'm going to make her wait for it. But tonight, you're going to get this tonight. <laughs> I already know Carly's not thinking about Caesar, because I already know later tonight, while we on this little island, she will come knocking at my door. I'm happy that we can all finally come to a trip. To Jamaica, come on. Jamaica. Y'all been together? Uh, How long been together, baby? Forever, ever. Oh. Forever, ever. Uh, we need some dates. Forever, ever. Yeah, how long y'all been together? Yeah, we, got, we ain't drinking well, we've been yet. together, we've been knowing each other what? Over 12 years. years. Yeah, Your 20 mama years. taught me. Your mama was his teacher. Mm. Oh, this is the perfect love story. Yeah. Oh. Seriously, like, we've been going back and forth for a while. Oh. Yeah, yo, but right yo, now, that real now. Yeah. It's just us. It's real okay. now. Yeah. That's what's up. Yeah. Like my other half. You're complete. Yeah. Feel complete, so right? it's just perfect. Well, you know, we're going to make it our way complete. You remember this right here? You going to do what? You remember this? Yeah, your grandma thing. My grandma thing? Well, we're gonna do it. Oh! oh. 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 oh my God. Oh, damn. Oh my God. Are you mad at me, sweetie? Yes, oh. baby. Oh. I gotta take this one out. Give it to me, sweetie. <laughs> I'm about to cry. <laughs> Never in a million years did I think that I was gonna come on this girl's trip and get engaged. I just feel like everything is complete, that everything that I've done for myself, being independent, that he saw it and he just wanted to make me his better half. And I just feel so good at this point and I'm so happy to become Mrs. Williams. I'll tell you how fast it was. We were together, what, three days? We drove back to Atlanta. We wrecked the Rolls Royce. <laughs> Third day, we hit a, my friend hit a wall, right? Yes. It's all the way around the expressway. I was so worried about her, never worried about the Rolls Royce. You know what I mean? I looked, that's when I knew I loved her. I was like, baby, I just wrecked the fire on it down. I'm like, I'm asking you, is you all right? Are you all right? <laughs> you straight, Aww. you know what I mean? And um, 
From there, I just knew, you know what I mean? I've been new. She a real woman, you know, a godly woman. You had my back, so I got yours, sweetie. Oh. Oh, my God. This has been the most romantic <laughs> trip of my life. Yeah. I am so happy for my girl, Dom. We all out here looking for love, and guess what? She found it. I guess you never know when the right one's gonna come along. All you could do in the meantime is just keep playing a romance game and just hope that nobody stomps in your heart. <laughs> so we're clear, Jock did not give me the D last night, and I didn't want it, but I didn't get my apology either. But we only have one more night in Jamaica, so I think it's time for me and Jock to leave whatever we had going on and focus on the future. Now I'm very happy for y'all, man, and to see everybody so happy. You know, I, I, I'm not always, uh, Right, Carly. But as a man, I was just gonna take the time to apologize for all the I've never put you through so we could lay it to rest. I wanna give a toast. Congratulations, Mr. and Mrs. Yes. But you know, so many things flipped and turned and ultimately, you know, we need to toast to them. Jamaica, I didn't want to say anything to the girls because I don't know for sure, but I wasn't not drinking at Spice's show because I was detoxing. For the past couple of weeks, I've just not been feeling good. I've been nauseous, tired. So today, I'm taking a test and I have a good feeling it's a baby in there. Well, this test needs to hurry up because I need to see right now. Yeah, I need to know too. I think I am. I feel just bloated. I'm just tired. My breast just feels sore. It looks so good. <laughs> <laughs> you ready to lose your body? Babe, I'm gonna bounce back like my mama. Speaking of her, you ain't even talk to your mama. And I ain't gonna talk to her. My mom and I have always had a complicated relationship. She sent me to Juvie when I was in high school judged me like crazy when I was dancing, and now that I'm grown, we still haven't found a way to get on the same page. When it comes to my mama, it's just me dealing with her and her attitude. My mama is not finna stress me out, especially if I'm pregnant, but it's like, I know at this point in time, if I am pregnant, I'm gonna need my mother. You gonna need a village if you're pregnant, you need some help. Cause I'm gonna be gone, I'm gonna be working somewhere. Sean was a first round pick when he joined the league back in 2006. But the last time he played an NBA game was about two years ago. He had some stumbles, but now he's making a run to get back in the game. You finna be gone. I'm finna have to finish playing in the wedding by myself. I got a lot of music I gotta put out. I got a lot of videos I gotta put out. This is a lot. I'm gonna hold you down almost definitely. I'm very proud of you. I'm proud of, you know, what you hustled up on. Oh, don't make me cry. I gotta cry. I love you. I love you too. <laughs> I need to see these results because I might be crying for nothing. <laughs> I'm scared to death. Prego. <laughs> well, hello. How are you? I'm doing good. So are you excited? I'm excited. I'm nervous. Why? It's my first baby. Okay. I just want everything to be good. I am 10 weeks along now, and today I'm having my first ultrasound. I can't believe I'm about to see my baby for the first time. I wish Sean could be here, but he's away trying out for teams now. So I'm all by myself on this one. Dad's here at all? Well, he's in and out. Oh. I've been really pretty much by myself. So who's your support system? Him. I don't really have anybody Good girl else. girlfriends, mama and them. Mm. Outside of Carly, good friends isn't really something I've collected since I've been in Atlanta. I don't do the fake or the phone. I'm want to stay away from the bull. So with Sean on the road, I definitely feel like I'm in this alone. The thing is, I haven't told anybody yet. My mom, my dad, 
know. It's times like this that I wish me and my mom were on better terms. But I'm already going through enough and I just don't have time to be arguing or hearing her judgmental attitude right now. All right, so we don't have a support system, but we're working on getting one. Yeah, I'm gonna have to patch some things up. I can't do this by myself. It's a lot of work. This is for real. It's not a game. Yeah. Yeah. So we're gonna get Renee to come in and do an ultrasound. Let's okay. still make sure it's only one baby. Yeah. <laughs> no one wants to go through a pregnancy alone, but that's just what it is for me. My mom is just not someone I can turn to right now, but maybe down the line. And so you can see what we see okay. on the screen here. Okay. Okay. Seeing the baby and hearing the heartbeat is going to make this all so real to me. Oh, he's jumping up and down. Oh. He said, hey, mama. Oh, hey, baby. And we call them all he's until we know. OK. <laughs> can we get a Doppler? Sure. was here at this moment, but he's doing what he has to do to make sure me and the baby are taken care of. Right now, I'm just focusing on having a healthy baby. We have some photos for Dad. Oh, my God. Oh, my baby. I'm so excited. Good. It's a <laughs> beautiful time. It is. I'm just a lot dealing with it on my own. much better now that I've heard my baby's heartbeat, which is a good thing because I have so much on my plate. Dr. Jackie is right. I do need some help. I wanted the invitations to be a little over the top. If you can dream it, we can do it. Sean and I have decided to have our wedding in Paris, and we're going to do it during All-Star Weekend so we can be sure he's going to be able to be there. to be here to help me pick out the invitations, but at the last minute, he told me he couldn't come. Carly is the only bridesmaid that's here in Atlanta, so I figured it's time to put her messy ass to work. So now, you said it's a destination. Yes. Where is that destination? Where am I going? Girl, where's the Eiffel Tower? <gasps> I can't think of anything more romantic than a wedding in Paris. I don't think I'm gonna be walking down the aisle anytime soon. So. I'll just live vicariously through time. I just really been a, a little overwhelmed, honestly. You know, doing all this planning and stuff, it's stressful. Sean was supposed to be here today, but last minute he had to stay back for practice or something. Well, you gotta do his thing so you can do your thing, because guess what? Bitch, you want a wedding in Paris. Mm -hmm. Oh, my God. <laughs> <laughs> I was just talking about you. I thought you could go. Oh. I made it. I made it. Heartbeat. Oh, you ain't supposed to. <laughs> There's a heartbeat. Oh, what you mean a heartbeat? I'm gonna let her fill you in on it. Well, you pregnant? Yes. <laughs> Hi, it's Auntie Carly. It's Auntie oh, Carly. <laughs> I knew there was something up with Dom. She hasn't been coming out like she usually do. She hasn't been drinking. Now I know why. Dom and Sean. They're gonna be amazing parents. It's a secret though, Carly. So don't go blabbing around town. Cause I haven't told anybody. Wait, mommy, you told mom? No. I haven't even been talking to her. That's crazy, right? The baby on the way, she gotta get that right, right? She's very difficult. We had a big argument. I said some things that she felt like I wasn't supposed to say or share. Her mom sent her to juvenile a long time ago. I really saw where she was coming from with that because my mama did me like that. She took a fist to that. She got to talking crazy about me and my marriage and just all type of stuff. And I was just like, nah. Regardless, she needs to be a part of it. She can be sitting right there. I know, I would love for her to. I really wish Dom would work it out with her mom. Now that it looks like I may not have as much time to spend with my dad as I like, I regret that we hadn't spent the time repairing our relationship sooner. Are you gonna talk to mama? What are you gonna do? I don't know yet. But I still want to share her pregnancy experience with her family, with her mom. Let me think about it and I'll get back with you. I'll make my decision. I'm about to be in my second trimester, and at least I'm not sick no more, but damn, I am tired. I 
been trying to plan a wedding and this little one here has been zapping the energy out of me. I'm so thankful to have Sean home for a visit. That's a fool. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Thank you. Ooh, look good. Ooh, I'm about to tear it up. I miss you being at home. I miss you too. Sean is home for a couple of days. He's been training so hard, and he's come so close to being picked up by a team. I have so much respect for him and what he's trying to do to take care of this family. But I miss him like crazy. I be so tired, I can't get up and fix nothing. You can't? But not if I'm here by myself. Well, you gonna need the help, because you ready to go to Iowa. I got this job with the Minnesota Timberwolves G League team, so. It's a bittersweet thing, but you know, it's good. That's good, huh, man? I'm so yeah, proud of you. Thank you, thank you. I've been out the league for two years now, and I've been busting my ass trying to get back in. But once you're sidelined, you gotta prove yourself to get back in. So I decided to sign with the Iowa Wolves, an affiliate of the Minnesota Timberwolves G League team. It's a humbling experience going from the professional rank to the minor rank, but I gotta do what I gotta do. Iowa, though. Yeah, up there in the snow. Go up there for about four months. Damn. I hate to leave you like this while you're in the midst of, you know, playing this wedding. This is what Sean has been working toward. And I was all good with the news until I heard four months. In four months, I'm going to be about to deliver this baby. I'm happy you got a job, but it's just like, dang, now I don't even know what to do. I don't have nobody to help me like that with the baby, with the wedding, nothing. Who going to help me with all this stuff? I don't know about that. This gonna give me more problems. And I don't wanna get mad because I'm already emotional. It's just emotional because you're pregnant. I know. But you need to get back cool with your mom. Like right? You need some more support. Take a village to raise a kid. Yeah, but that village crazy. Who have you told you pregnant? Carly. That's all I think. That's crazy. How you ain't told your mom yet? Like, what you wanna do? Just call out the blue and just say, hey, mom, I'm pregnant, even though me and you ain't been talking. We just got a lot of issues that's passed that we have not worked out. Just give me some time. <sighs> By the time I can't pick nothing up or see my feet, maybe we'll be able to talk about it. Oh, man. Sean's already back in Iowa, and I'm lonely as hell. I think he's feeling a little guilty for leaving me alone because he called to tell me to expect a surprise visitor. It's a good surprise. Hey! Hey, Jaybird. How you doing? <laughs> hey, Mom. I should have known Sean was up to no good. I haven't spoken to my mom in months. And that's nothing new. Our relationship has been strained for years. But Sean feels like I need my mom more than ever now. Personally, I don't think I need the stress. It's a beautiful house, Jessica. Thank it's you. Gorgeous. What you doing here? Sean flew me down. Did he? He knows that we haven't seen each other in over a year, mm. and we haven't spoken in months. Sean wants us to get whatever it is straightened out, Just Yeah. When I was in New York, I said some things you probably didn't like, that you sent me to Juvenile. You called and you said you were upset about him, and you said some things, I said some things, and we haven't talked since then. You know, Jessica, this has been going on for almost two decades. Yeah. We have our times where we'll fall out because you want things to go how you want it to go. You're a little controlling sometimes. I was taken aback when I found out you were dancing. What I did was I asked God to protect you from all danger seen and unseen, and that's what he's done. Yeah. I'm really, really proud of you, and I want you to understand that. This is from my heart. Thank you. It's good to hear that, because he was so mad at me about it for so long. You'll never be able to understand how I felt mm -hmm. until you become a mother yourself. Well, I may know sooner than you think. Why? Pregnant. <laughs> I'm getting ready to be a grandmother. <laughs> Jessica! <laughs> I'm relieved to finally share my pregnancy with my mom. And to see her so happy about it, it really warms my heart. And now that I'm about to become a mother myself, I finally see where she was coming from. What you crying about? <laughs> It's just a, it's 
a happy time. But it is a happy time. It's a lot to deal with. Well, I'll be coming back and forth. Well, good. I really will. Because I'm going to be a grandma. It doesn't get any better than that, Jessica. Hopefully, we can keep this going. Yeah, yeah we are going to keep it going. <laughs> Jaybird. <laughs> We haven't told too many people that we're having a baby. It was just something Diane wanted to keep private until she was further along. But Diamond's showing now, and it's time to confirm all the rumors. We decided to hold off on the wedding until the baby comes, but we determined to have a celebration. I already know the gender of the baby, but I can't wait to see Dime's expression when she finds out. You gotta rub your hands like this. Oh. Oh. Ah, we got ladies in the pink and we got ladies in the blue. Ah. You see Mama D looking like a 20 year old. Hey, girl. Dime has been missing in action for a while. And then out of the blue, I get an invitation to a party. No mention of what it is or what it's for. But seeing all these pink and blue balloons, it's pretty obvious why Dime hasn't been partying with us. She's got a little mini dime in that belly, and it looks like today we're going to find out if it's a girl or a boy. So what are we doing? What, what, what's going on? I'm just waiting on this better hand to come in here. I mean, it don't take too much to kind of piece what's going on. Yeah. Really? Yeah, for sure. Well, there ain't gonna be nothing little about that thing, cause y'all. Like me, me, y'all. You, I got you a hundred dollars. You can't hit that one hand. Bet it. Oh no. You got cash up? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Buddies, and I'm finally about to find out what my little bundle of joy is. Well, I got another surprise for you. My number one support system, Sean, has been the best ever. Sean, just wait till we get home. We're going to tell you your gender and the baby you have. Oh. It's going to explode. It's going to Wait, 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 wait. What you think it is? <laughs> I, think it's, I think it's a girl. You think it's a girl? I think it's a girl. Okay, give the money shot. in the ways that she should go. Never be like Ernest Mama, keep them here from real life. Teach her to be independent yeah. and to stand on her own. Congratulations. Thank you, Mama D. Oh my God, I'm gonna have a little girl. So I'm having a girl. I'm so happy. Now I got a little mini dime running around town. So y'all beware. I really And thank right. you, thank you so much yeah. for Mending this relationship. That's all good. You, you did Y'all gonna keep him in it. You trying to? Yeah. <laughs> thank you, thank you. We're gonna try. Oh, I love you so much. Oh, I love you, I love you. Thank you for making me a black papa. I'm so excited. <laughs> my baby shower. All of my dreams are really coming true. <laughs> Thank you. I'm glad you came. so much. Everybody has come to my baby shower. I was just so happy to be around all the love and everybody welcoming baby Williams into the world. Oh, you let people touch your belly? Yeah. Okay, okay. It is a party, honey, and I'm happy to see everybody. See? <laughs> you look beautiful. 
Jessica Dime and Sean. You know, it's an amazing God gift, man, and a blessing to have a seed on the way. You know what I'm saying? Oh, believe me, I know. I just want to say I appreciate everybody for coming. What, Miss Diana? Miss Chapman, what's up? <laughs> My mom, I finally see where she was coming from. All a parent really wants to do is keep their child safe and happy. I feel like I finally have the support system that I've been looking for now. I am ready for my grandbaby. Yeah! Mother and daughters always had their differences, but you were a great mother. And I hope I can just be just as much as a little mother and work to oh. make my life. She was kind of calm, you know, at first, but I'm knowing deep down inside that my baby nervous, so I'm just there, you know, being cool and just trying to comfort her. Yeah. I was getting a little nervous, but hey, I said a prayer and just put it in God's hand. I'm overwhelmed, I'm excited, and I can't wait to be a mother. I can't wait to see her face, kiss her little cheeks, and just spoil her. I cannot wait. I can't wait to see her. Safari, listen, thanks for watching, and you are now tuned in with the brand new Love and Hip Hop YouTube, all right? Subscribe, click it, there's a button right there, hit it right there, and subscribe, all right? Cheer!